to you. I know that you would take a bullet for me. I would for you as well. What were you doing on the computer? Yeah, I photographed my girl. I was doing the same thing. You want to see her? Got three. One, two, three, two. That's Lauren. Well, we wanted to protect the choice and make sure that it seemed as though she may end up with this guy. She may end up with that guy. And I remember I showed the picture to Reese early on and she looked at me three quarters of the way through the picture and said, I don't know who I'm going to choose. So that's a, it's an important thing to protect and they're such worthy guys. Don't let your country down, boys. This has been a perfect night. Make it rain. It's like a great mixtape. A smorgasbord or an amalgam. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> words with friends. Mixed eggs were the best. Yeah, yeah they, they were, weren't they? <laughs> it doesn't happen anymore. No. What do, I wonder what people do now. Adolescents. They make CDs. But you don't make CDs anymore. Digital playlists. You know what you make? Yeah, digital playlists. Right. You make mm. a firewall. <laughs> I think that's something else. Or a, you know, a... Um, Ripstick. Ripstick. Mm. I mean, what a struggle. Okay, I have to go home and clean tartar sauce out of Bob's beard. And you're going to sit here and talk to me about how amazing these two guys are? Is there anything bad about them? Okay, let me think. Flaws. FDR has these tiny, like, girl hands. Like little T-Rex hands. <laughs> we shot several endings to the picture. And we may even release two versions of the picture. So you never know what you're going to get when you go into the theater. And it's the New World Order. There are a great many ways to release films these days. So you're not backing off? Nope. 